Hello guys, Hoover Central. And as you know, I've made a post about 12 days ago saying if you want me to make a review of cylinder vacuums, upright vacuums, and Battle of All Vacuums and Battle of Henry's, as you can see, I've got three. And let me just introduce you to the new vacuums that you probably haven't seen. Here is the Nilfisk GS90 from 1980. Then over here we've got the Panasonic MCE746, which I have made a video of sucking up socks and a review on all the carpets. Then here's a Tesco vacuum I found and it was flooded but now it's working. And Henry 200, we've also got him too, he works now, new motor. And as you can see I've only got one carcher with me today, well sadly as you can see the motor blew up in this one because it was clogged with dirt and it start, started going bib, 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 bib. And this is the mess for today. We've got sawdust and dust, glitter and very fine dust that's all rubbed into the carpet. Everything rubbed into the carpet, mostly. And we'll be starting with the Dyson Kinetic Big Ball Animal. I swear. wasn't plugged in properly the power cable <laughs> And let's go on to the next room. Unplug. Again. That one. This one. This one. And this one. Now we'll be doing this room with the Karcher, Nilfesk, Panasonic and Tesco vacuum. <laughs> this Nilfisk got a really good design. So if you turn it like that, there's a hole at the bottom for suction for carpets and hard floor, no carpet. Then you switch it this way, that's for hard floors. And we have to use it on the carpet, and cut, obviously it's a carpet.
as you can see it's very stiff and the pulls are very bendy but now we'll show you the results out of eight vacuums in eighth place came the Nilfisk GS90 in seventh place came the Henry HVR200 in sixth place came the Henry HVR200 from 2006 in fifth place came the Panasonic MCE746 in fourth place came the Henry 200 in third place came the Karcher T10-1 Advanced Professional in second place came the Tesco Vacuum and in first place came the Dyson Kinetic Big Ball Animal so since the Dyson Kinetic Ball Big, the big Ball Animal won we will be sucking up all this mess silly me I forgot to plug this in up with an upright vacuum I'll be back and now you probably haven't seen before a junior this is a very rare vacuum and it does really good as you can see with this little mark I done testing it see if it would switch on and it does make all the sawdust go in your eyes so I might be blind by the time this is done <laughs> show that on camera sadly but um next time we might do upright vacuums and then henry's and then maybe just maybe if we can do all the vacuums which is about 21 and we barely managed to fit 14 all over here so i might have to do like 10 another 10 and then two at that side if I can manage so it will be two different kind of things I don't know what's gonna happen but Hoover Central out bye <laughs>